Okay. Good afternoon. I'd like to welcome everyone to the 2011-2012 Youth Week Campaign Assembly. The candidates have prepared speeches and are anxious to present them to us. I would like to remind everyone that Tuesday, November 8th, is election day and we will be choosing who we want to represent our class. Please listen to all the speeches before you make your choices. Alex Rodriguez will be our master of ceremonies. Let the competition begin. Good afternoon, administrators, teachers, candidates, and the fellow student classmates. Today is our final opportunity to hear from each of the 2011-2012 Youth Week candidates. Please give each candidate your consideration and remember to exercise your right to vote on November 8th, Tuesday. I'd like now to introduce our mayoral candidates, Thomas Delikov and Drew Mascot. Please give them... Hello everyone, my name is Tom Delikov and I am running for the mayor of the Gold Party. Being mayor is very important to me because there is a lot of positive changes that I would like to make to our wonderful town of Totowa and right here in our school. I have lived here in Totowa my whole life and I plan to remain here in the future. I have a brother who attends Washington Park School as a fourth grader and is very active in sports. I enjoy living in Totowa as you all do and want to keep it clean and safe for everyone. Recently, many of you were affected by flooding and electrical outages. As your mayor, I would, like, I would make sure that everyone was safe and had food and shelter for as long as they needed. If I am elected mayor, I will help you by listening to your opinions and getting your needs met. The community is important and everyone's opinion counts. Please vote for me for mayor of the Gold Party and we can make this town shine. Yeah, what's up? Now you obviously know why I stand here before you. It's starting to be bored out of your minds. You're probably expecting this. I should be mayor because blah, 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 blah. My goal is to keep your attention while reading this to you. Now in the previous year, I ran for vice president of the student council. I lost, but after a week of the election, I realized why. Wait, no. Okay. I was sending off the wrong vibe I wanted to give you. Perhaps uh, I had a better chance if I had spoken in a calmer tune. After that, I gave up on electing. I didn't want what happened last year to happen again. So Mrs. Brilliadoro said that I should partake this year for Youth Week. I just wanted to go to Washington, so I did. But then I left the Silver Party winners, and I realized that I won. This means that the entire Silver Party recommended me for mayor. So I decided to try one more time as I have the entire civil party backing me up. Kings, chiefs, the boss, they all have something in common, leadership qualities. Being a leader is the utmost importance for being a mayor, governing your designated town and making sure that everything stays intact. I can be that person, even though it will take some getting used to. If I stood here talking to others about me being mayor without thinking that I can do it, then I would have walked out of here right now. I can do it. I can be the mayor. So do not forget to vote for Jerome Mascotta of the Silver Party. Yeah. Thank you, Tom and Jerome. Next, we have our police chief candidates, Danielle Sol and Andrew Fuentes. Please give them your full and undivided attention. Fellow classmates, I'm running for the position of chief, of chief of Police on the Silver Party. As Chief, I will ensure that our tax dollars are used in the most efficient manner. I will keep the department staff so it is safe for the officers and the minimal impact to our taxpayers. Vote for me, Danielle Sol, Silver Party for Chief of Police. Thank you. Thank you. 
Good afternoon. I am Andrew Fuentes and I am running for Chief of Police Gold Party. As Chief of Police, I will be responsible for working for and with citizens to enrich the quality of life within Totowa. Vote for me for Chief of Police Gold Party. Thank you, Andrew and Daniela. Now we will hear from candidates for the position of Fire Chief, Casey Broadfield and Dante Iadici. Give them your full and undivided attention. Good afternoon, the class of 2012. My name is Casey Broadfield, as most of you know, and I'm running for fire chief on the gold party ballot. I am running for fire chief because my family is a firehouse family. My dad has been a volunteer fireman for 35 years, and my brother has been one for 12 years. My mom, my sister-in-law, and I all help and sacrifice our time to help the Passaic Valley region firehouses. This all might sound boring, but this position is very important to me. It is a great honor to live with people who put their lives in the line of fire every day. I can picture myself helping the Totoa Fire Department in many, many ways if I get voted as fire chief. So if you want Totoa to be safe of fires and preventive of floods, then vote me for fire chief. Once again, thank you for your cooperation. Hello and good afternoon, class of 2012. Most of you already know who I am, but for those of you who do not, my name is Dante Udici. I stand before you all today in hopes of being elected as your 2011-2012 Municipal Fire Chief. I stand for the Silver Party. You may ask, why should he be Fire Chief? Well, I feel for one that I am very responsible. I am in both accelerated math as well as reading, both of which, both of which I achieve highly in. I also have yet to miss one homework assignment this year and have high hopes for continuing this. Not only that, I participate in recreational soccer at the PAL, which at times can be very time consuming. Although I do still manage to balance out my schoolwork along with my other activities. Now you may say, okay, so then why should he be fire chief? As far as I know, fire chief has multiple responsibilities that the community relies on to be carried out. The fire chief is responsible for organization and direction of the volunteer fire department in order to ensure that loss of life, property, or injury as a result of fire is prevented and or minimized. I am very good with working with others and have several leadership qualities that are essential to the job of fire chief. For one, for one I am very, I'm usually the first to volunteer to and take charge whenever we work at school on class projects. Not only that, I'm very controlling. With that said, I don't mean I block everyone else out and take matters into my own hands. I mean that I'm willing to take control regardless of how serious the situation may be. All in all, I believe that I would be an outstanding candidate for the total municipal fire chief. Vote Dante Udici as your 2011-2012 municipal fire chief. Thank you and have a wonderful day. Good job. Go that way. Thank you, Casey and Dante. Next, we have the candidates for chief school administrator, Jennifer DeMonsity and Nicole Irado. Please give them your full and undivided attention. Thank you. <clears throat> my fellow classmates, I am Nicole Urato and I stand here today representing myself as Chief School Administrator. I understand that it is an immense responsibility for someone like myself to run for this type of position. I am aware that I have to commit 100%. I am not worried. If I lose, I'd still know that I tried my best, and that's all that matters. I am running for this type of position because I know what I am capable of. I recognize my strengths, personality, bravery, and most importantly, my academic skills. I don't give up easy. You have to remember that I am the type of girl that commits to something. That's why I think this would be a great opportunity for me. I stand up here today because I feel that it is only right. I want to do what is best for the students, and I have a lot to offer. If you vote for me, I promise that I would stay by your side. Whatever the situation, I promise I would stick with you guys through thick and thin. If you vote for me, you will never regret it. I promise, and I keep my word. Thank you. Hi, I'm Jennifer Mossinus, and I would like to run for Chief Administrator. The job of the Chief School Administrator is to oversee all operations of Washington Park School and Memorial School. He or she is responsible for running the school system and accountable to the board regarding how well the school is run. I think all teachers should give extra help if a student is failing with the 64 or under. And I also think no one should be made fun of, and if someone is, there would be a severe consequence for it. Thank you, and vote for me. Thank you, Jennifer and Nicole. 
Now we have the candidates for principal. Steven Jajura, Samantha Kaprowski, Katie Sedita, and Ariana Sverdland. Hi, I'm not going to take up too much of your time, so I'm going to make my speech short and sweet. I'm Steve DeJore, and I'm going for principal for Silver Party. As a principal, I will bring fun to the school, fundraisers, and field trips. Also, responsibility is very important in my family. Lastly, I will give you a great education so life will be easy for you. Vote for me, Steve DeJore, for Silver Party. Hello, students and faculty. I am Samantha Kaprowski, and I'm running to be your next principal. The principal, the principal juggles a myriad of important duties. They attend Board of Education meetings, review NJS scores, implement beneficial programs, set up teacher conferences, make fundraisers, and monitor students. Most importantly, they are a kind friend and a good role model to all students. You should vote for me because I am kind, trustworthy, responsible, and smart. As you can see, I have all the essential qualities that make me the best choice for your next principal. Thank you for your time and consideration, and may the best candidate win. Principal. The job of a principal is very important. Principals are exactly what sets the mood of the school. Without pr the principal, schools would not run the same. My name is Katie Sedita, and I'm running for principal on Gold Party. Principal. The person who makes sure everything is running smoothly. The person who sets a tone for the whole school. The person who brings new programs to the school. Those are some jobs that the principal does. The principal needs to be organized and be able to work with other people. I have all those qualities. Vote for me, Ariana Swin, Gold Party for Principal. Thank you, everyone. Now we have Chris Romano, who will introduce the candidates for Gold Party Board of Ed. Good afternoon. The Board of Education is committed to achieving education, educational excellence in the area of academics, visual and performing arts, and athletics. The following candidates are running for the Gold Party Board of Education. Ahmed Abohaltum. <laughs> Angela Galas. Kyle Guerreri. Thomas Henyon. Taylor Malley. Dylan Masir. Jasmine Pabone, Teresa Reynolds, and as well as myself, Chris Armagno. I would, like, I would also like to mention, running for the Gold Party, David Boldega, Board of Ed Attorney. And Thomas Koprowski, Guidance Counselor. These are the 2011-2012 candidates. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Next, we will hear from for the candidates running for tax collector, Julian Perez. Hello, my name is Julian Perez, and I'm running for the position of tax collector with the Silver Party. I believe I am the most qualified candidate for this position. I promise to keep funds and property money organized. For some people, accessing taxes are a hard job, but for me, there will be no problem. Vote Julian Perez for tax collector. Thank you, Zach and Julian. Zach and Julian. Now to introduce the Youth Week candidates video presentation, it is my honor to ask our student council president, John Alisi, to please come, come up on stage. Hey everyone, here we have the videos for all our council reps, Gold and Silver Party. A lot of a decent amount of work went into the filming of these productions and they turned out really nice. We would especially like to thank Mr. Darius for all of his help. And we hope you enjoy. Without further ado. Hello, 
my name is Jamar Teaching. I'm running for the position of Board of Ed Attorney on the Silver Party. You should vote for me because I will represent our district in a sufficient way. Here are my fellow candidates. Hi, I'm Ashley Pavone and I'm running for the position of Guidance Counselor on the Silver Party. You should vote for me because I'm genuinely caring and a good listener. Hi, my name is Alexa Colon and I'm running for a position on the Board of Education in the Silver Party. Please vote for me because I'm responsible, loyal, and I fulfill my position as the Board of Education. Hi, my name is Gianna Dibus. I am running for the Board of Education on the Silver Party. You should vote for me because I am very responsible and I will change your school in the best possible way. My name is Nick Lavajak. I'm on the Silver Party running for position of Board of Education. You should vote for me because I'll do what's best for the school. Hello, my name is Giuseppe Mara and I'm running for the position of Board of Education in the Silver Party. You should vote for me because I am an excellent student and know what's best for our school. Hi, I'm Alexa Mitchell and I'm running for a position on the Board of Education. On the Silver Party, you should vote for me because I'm very responsible and a good student. Hi, I'm Courtney Dundere and I'm running for the position of Municipal Clerk on the Silver Party. You should vote for me because I'll fulfill my duties and never neglect my responsibilities. Here are my fellow candidates. Hello, my name is Julian Perez and I'm running for the position of Tax Collector in the Silver Party. You should vote for me because I'll keep your funds nice and tidy. Hi, my name is Adriana Vaccaro. I'm running for the position of tax assessor in the Silver Party. You should vote for me because I'm responsible. Hello, my name is Nicholas Quintero, and I'm running for Municipal Council on the Silver Party. You should vote for me because I'd be a huge asset to the Municipal Council. Hello, my name is Jalisa Velasquez. I'm running for the Municipal Council in the Silver Party. You should vote for me because I'm responsible and caring. You won't regret it. What wonderful videos. Lastly, A Laith Abraham will introduce candidates who are running unopposed. Laith? Running unopposed is Business Administrator Richard Mann. <laughs> Tax Assessor Adriana Baccaro. Municipal Clerk, Courtney Dundero. <laughs> Municipal Engineer, Brittany Patton. <laughs> Supervisor of Pupil Personnel Services, Brianna Dilley. <laughs> and me, Lathy Bram, as Municipal Attorney. <laughs> Here's my speech. I, Lathy Bram, am running for municipal attorney. I am fully qualified for this position and in both accelerated reading and math. When I get older, I want to pursue this job and I believe I can do a great job. As great Abraham Lincoln always said, always bear in mind that your own resolution to succeed is more important than anything else. I embrace that and I shall not stop till I'm on top. Mm. Thank you, Laith. Thank you, Laith. <clears throat> now to close the 2011-2012 Youth Week presentation, as her own Miss Brigliadoro will now present her speech. I'd like to congratulate the candidates on their fine performances. All speeches were excellent. Please remember that Tuesday is election day, and you, the voter, have the most important job. But can one person's vote make a difference? Absolutely. In 1776, one vote made English the official language of the United States instead of German. In 1845, one vote saved President Johnson from impeachment. In 1923, one vote elected Adolf Hitler, the leader of a new political party in Munich. So yes, every vote counts. I would like to thank all the eighth grade teachers, Mr. Darius, Mrs. Conforth, and the administrators. Have a good weekend and vote wisely. Thank you.
This concludes our Youth Week Assembly. Thank you.